I remember, yeah, watching porn 10 times in one day. I know. In one day, when I was 18, 10 times. Imagine. 10 times in one day. Porn is so addictive. It is so addictive. I'm not going to lie to none of you. And I came to a realization that the reason why porn is so addictive is because we've been programmed as, as young men, men in general, we've been programmed since maybe 13, 14. It depends what age you started watching it. It all depends what age you started. I started at 12, yeah, 12, 13, yeah, I started at 12. So imagine, I'm 24 right now, imagine how many years that is. You know, that's, so we've been programmed since we were young and you release a dopamine. Once you go on a website and you click on your favorite P star and you, uh, the dopamine, maybe you were stressed, you had a bad day at school, work, your wife, girlfriend is not giving you the box, she's keeping the box hostage. What is the solution? Is to go on the website and click your favorite P star, or maybe. Your wife or girlfriend is not satisfying your needs. What is the next step? P. So we've been programmed since we was a young. And some of us never get out of that trap. Some of us never get out. We stay on that program forever. Forever. You know? And once you watch it once, it will continue, 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 continue. It becomes like a, not even like a, it becomes an addiction. It becomes something that you think about at least once a day. Most of us think about porn once a day. Maybe more, maybe more. Some of you, maybe 10 times, 20 times, 100 times a day. You know, it all depends on individuals. Anyway, you think about it during the day. And when you go home at night or before work or in the morning, you have to release and go to work so you can make you feel peace. You know? So there are many reasons why porn is so addictive. But I'm going to say the main reason is because you release some type of stress, dopamine. Because once you're in that position, you go home, maybe you release. Even though you know after you release, you'll feel like shit. You still do it because at the moment, it feels good, it feels amazing. And the, the crazy thing is that though, even though after you release, you feel bad. The next day, maybe the next week, the next month, you will still go back and do it again. It becomes an addiction and it's hard to escape. But it's possible to escape where you will take a lot of self-evaluation, self-search to be able to escape. It's not an overnight thing. To escape porn, is definitely not, definitely not an overnight thing. It's a, it's a lot of mental, physical work. It's a lot. Because if it wasn't for society, government, none of us would know about porn. If it wasn't for social media, None of us will know 
about porn on the fence we would none of us would know we wouldn't know but now that it's in our face it's hard to escape you know it's addiction it's like smoking weed or drinking it's all addiction it's all addiction you know and i remember when i was 18 i done it 10 times in that one day it was on a sunday night a sunday night yeah i done it 10 times did i feel good after no i felt like I felt like a bitch. I was a fuck. <laughs> I still remember it to this day. To this day, I still remember that that day. I still remember that day to this day. And damn, <laughs> if we're thinking about it now, I'm like, wow, I done that in one day. In one day. But you know, it's okay. We move on. We move on. Now, I'm helping men to be able to escape as well. Because I document. I documented how many days I'm going to go without it. And I have done it. And I'm going to continue doing it. You know? It's not a easy, it's not easy to escape. It will take you time, a lot of time, a lot of self-evaluation. It will take you a lot of self-evaluation. But once you find it, you can escape. Because, man, anything is that, any addition is just a full good moment. Once you do it, let's say I sit down right here and I go on my favorite piece star and I do it. It feels good. Yeah. It feels so good. But I'm doing more damage to myself. You know? And Man, I'm still thinking about ten times. Fuck. Let me let me get serious. Anyways, listen. Porn is addictive because society program all of us men to be able to watch it over and over and over again. Because one is not enough, two is not enough, three is not enough. That's what more. Because there's how many P star are there? Plenty. They're more than. 50 p star more than that and then every single time the new one are coming a 17 year old is turning 18 i know it's sound messed up but i'll just our generation i'm sorry our generation is messed up god help us anyways listen it's 16 year old turning 17 you know some countries 16 year old they start they can do the p you know what i i know it sounds crazy it's because age of consent in this country uk 16 a lot of you, maybe in your country as well, 16, I don't know. Germany is 14. Damn. Anyways. <laughs> so imagine 16, 15, 10, 16. So she, she can start a piece, piece only fans, whatever. So every single year, you get new, new, new star. So now you're a poor guy. You, you want something new. Ooh. This one got a bigger ass, a bigger tits, a beautiful, better face, a better lip. A better nose, a better eyelashes, a, a, I don't know, a better, a better feet. Some guys got fit, fetish, I don't know. Listen, you get poor, Graham. So every single year, you're coming back. Every single day, not every day, yeah? Every single day, you're coming back. New one are coming. Because every single day, someone is turning right now. 
someone is turning 18 right now right now someone is turning 18 someone is turning 16 someone is turning 14 age of concern i'm just saying don't youtube don't ban me i'm just being honest age of concern in germany is 14. go and do your research anyways so every single time you get the program we we are all damaged men and women we are all damaged i'm damaged as well of course everyone is damaged some people are more damaged than others but i believe everyone are damaged and the only solution is free solution purpose once you find your purpose that can recover your, your damagedness. The next one is actual love from your people, family, friends. Because love right now is conditional for most people. And a lot of people know this. They, they know people don't have to love me for me. They're conditional. But once you have a conditional love, Hopefully you can come back. I believe you can come back. The last one, not least, is God. God have to come down and help us. If not, that's the way it is. Thank you for watching. And I hope, I love you. Let me say, before I leave, I want to say I love all of you. All of you subscribers, I love you. Let me take a shot. All of you subscribers, I love you. I don't care if you're going through hard times. I believe in all of you. I love all of you. And God continue to bless all of you. And thank you for watching. God bless.